Hello, my name is Dr. David Cathcart, and I'm from Heartland Regional Medical Center in St. Joseph, Missouri. To become a physician, it first requires that you graduate from high school. You have to have a uh, you have to have a high school diploma, and then you have to go to college. Almost all medical programs require that you go to four years of undergraduate, usually uh, with a degree in the sciences, perhaps chemistry or biology. Uh, and then then four years of medical school. So you're looking at at minimum of eight years after you graduate from high school of schooling before you even get the degree doctor bestowed upon you. But that's not it, because at that point you still have to do a residency. A residency is where you uh, uh, practice whatever area you're going to be in uh, under the supervision of people who are skilled in that particular area. So for example, if uh, in my case, if you, uh, I was a family practice doctor, you would go into a family practice residency and usually that's going to be two or three years. Uh, surgeons, certain surgical disciplines will be four years or even eight or 10 years, depending on the area that you're going into. For example, neurosurgery, the residency programs are, are many years, usually like eight years or more. Uh, same thing with cardiovascular surgery, if you're going to be doing heart transplants. General surgery is more on the order of four years for most programs. But at the very minimum, uh, after you get out of medical school, so you've done four years of college, four years of medical school, you're looking at uh, any more, at least an additional three years just before you can even go out and start practicing um, as a physician. Thanks for taking this time to explore medical careers with me. Again, I'm Dr. David Cathcart with Heartland Regional Medical Center in St. Joseph, Missouri.